final of the Club World Cup. Welcome to Rabat. For day seven, we're almost at the end of the trip. I'm getting so sad because I'm loving Morocco. I want to stay forever. So smash the like button if you want to see more Moroccan content. Today, we're driving to Tonja. We're not getting the train. So it's a little bit of a longer journey, but we've got to make Flamengo versus Al Hilal in the stadium. Let's go. Two and a half hour drive complete. We are back in Tonja. It feels so good to be here in the north of Morocco. Big match tonight. Flamengo fans, their red and black scarves. I'm seeing them wave everywhere. I'm so excited to go into the city and see the fans. But let's get into the hotel. Welcome to the hotel room. Now, I've already said how beautiful Tonja is, but let me run it through. Okay, you come through here. We've got the bathroom, the bed. It's all a little bit rosy. Beautiful blue skies. When is it not blue in Morocco? And of course, Tonja, where the match will be played tonight. This is gonna be exciting. The reason I make videos like this is because I wanna separate that boundary between Moroccans and English. People should be coming here on holiday. Look how beautiful it is. We've even got the football on. So if you're into that, like I am, that's why I'm here. I wanna break down that barrier. I wanna show you how beautiful it is and how good the people are. It's very welcoming. Let's enjoy it. Mate, how's it look? It looks beautiful, mate. Seafood <laughs> pasta. Come on. He's only started getting on seafood pasta whilst. I'm cultured, bro. Yeah, you're starting to get cultured because of Morocco. He's teaching I'm cultured. you. Morocco's teaching me. Enough for me, mate. Look at that. I'm not complaining either, mate. This looks unbelievable. We got the mash, we got the vegetables, the beef. It's going to disappear in a sec. The power of YouTube. It's disappeared. And we've got a tea. What a stunning country. Come here. Come here. Look at this. This is how much it matters in Brazil, this tournament, okay? <sighs> This is how Flamengo sent their coach off to the airport to fly to Morocco. This is insane. Here we are, we've made it to Batuta for the big game. Flamengo, yeah, Flamengo for sure. Flamengo, yeah? yeah? Everyone supports Flamengo today. Flamengo. Flamengo, uh, yeah? Flamengo. Uh, two on uh, zero. One zero. One, one, one zero. zero. Well, Flamengo. One zero. Raja fan. Yeah. Big up. We, we're taking a tally. Who's got the biggest club in Morocco? It's Raja, yeah? Yeah, Raja, yeah. <laughs> Who's going to win today? Flamengo. Flamengo. Of course. Are, they, are they the biggest team in Brazil? Yeah. Yeah. Easy. Easy. Easily, yeah? Today, uh, Flamingo. Flamingo. Yeah. Who's gonna win today? Flamingo. Yeah. So the Club World Cup is yours this year? Yeah, of course. What do you think of Fluminense? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Three zero. Three zero? Three zero two. Okay, what are you going for? Two zero. 2-0, tough match. Gabi, go hat three. Oh, 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 oh. We're gonna sing the one for Liverpool. Really? Okay. Yeah, we beat them 3-0 in 1981. <laughs> <laughs> Liverpool are shaking right now. New shirt, all the Moroccan fans, they always find a new club to get a picture. This time it's Tonja. I don't think I need to explain what's just happened. We've met Al Hilal, we've met Flamengo. People have travelled all the way from Brazil for the Club World Cup. That's how much it means today. Now, I don't know how many people are going to be inside that stadium in two hours, but one thing I've pointed out already is the love is insane. So many nice gestures, so many nice people I met outside the stadium. Positivity, that's always on the channel, so big up the community. Just met Moisin. Look at the hat. Thank I love you. the hat. Yes. The proper Moroccan style here. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Flamengo, of course. You support Flamengo, that's why it's Brazil. Of course. Are you sure? Yes, yes. It's it's too kind. Kind. Thank you. It's for me now. I'm wearing it. I'm keeping it. What a guy. Yeah. We <laughs> teamed up with Ben Black and I'm not happy, this man. Sorry bro, you can have it back. <laughs> he stole my whole flow, word for word, bar for bar. Even the security guards. I've taken more pictures today than any other football match and I go to so many games for my channel, but one thing for sure, I will not say no to anybody. First time seeing the stadium, obviously we went for the first game, but now the Brazilians are here. Let's see if there's any around. But let's 
pause the scenery and get down to business. The FIFA Club World Cup may be seen as nothing more than a mid-season sideshow to most European fans. But taking that trophy away from the continent that has won it each of the last nine editions would be a sweet victory for South America. If Flamengo are to do just that and emulate the last common ball side to win the trophy since Corinthians 2012, they must justify their favourites tag against Al Halal, their semi-final opponents in the 2019 edition. That time, they were 1-0 down at half-time but ended up defeating them 3-1. And if form matters at all, it's expected to happen again as Al Halal only scraped past Weedad Casablanca whilst Flamengo sit top of the Brazilian first tier. Led by power duo Pedro and Gabriel Barbosa, they're expected to win tonight. To make matters worse for the Saudis, they find themselves in yet another hostile atmosphere with masses of Flamengo supporters already in Tonja. So let's get out there and see what it means to the Brazilians. <laughs> They won on penalties against Riedad and they also have to deal with a green laser once again. Whenever we play in this part of the world, the green laser comes out. Look at that, the laser. Arturo Vidal's coming on for Flamengo, but he won't be able to save them because they're 3 1 down. Oh my god! The Brazilians have scored. All of a sudden, it's game on. Flamengo have scored to 10 men just before added time. Pedro's scored a second, and he's made those Brazilians something to cheer about. Six minutes additional time. 
for the Brazilians to take this game to extra time. Let's find out if they can do it. Oh my God, surely not. Gabby, oh. Nearly a Gabby goal. Oh, hello, already celebrating. Their bench is already cheering. They think it's all over. The banner, the Al Halal banner is out. I think it's done. Referee, blow your whistle. And he has. <laughs> Al Halal are into the final of the Club World Cup, making Saudi history. It's over here in Morocco. Semi final one complete. Al Halal are in the final. Thank you so much for supporting me. When I fly back to England, all these memories, all these people, all the selfies, the conversations, I won't forget a thing because at the end of the day, Moroccans are some of the nicest and kindest people ever. Thank you Visit Morocco as well for making it possible to go to this. They provided the tickets and helped me with the experience. Smash the like button and we will go to Real Madrid tomorrow. If we hit 20,000 likes, we will wake up, set our alarm and go back to Rabat to watch Real Madrid Al Ali. Good night, see you tomorrow if we hit it. Bye-bye.